Hello again, Interwebs. Welcome back. My name is Tethys, and today we are going to be playing Stardew Valley. This was suggested by a couple of my friends, as well as some of you in the comments, so I figured, why not play it? Let's just quickly... It's nice that I've got my camera set up so I can set a look at myself. That sounded really conceited. because I have seen it before, but for some of you who haven't, we shall watch it. And for my very special grandson. I want you to have the sealed envelope. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. X years later. Geez, well that's just happy. Oh, Jesus, skeleton. <laughs> if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Tethys Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast, and the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name my boy could love with, Grandpa. P.S. is Lou if Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me. it's still true or not but from what I recall this game was made is made by one person so it's absolutely insane just how much stuff is in this game for one person you must be Tethys I'm Robin the local carpenter Mayor Lou sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home he's there right now tidying things up Farm's right over here if you'll follow me.
This is Tethys Farm. matter. Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleared up in no time. Honestly, it doesn't look that bad. And here we are, your new home. The new farmer. Welcome, I'm Lewis, Mayor Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. That's one way of putting it. Rustic. <laughs> I called it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Rude? Don't listen to her, Tethys. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Ooh. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. Townspeople would appreciate that. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Well, good luck. I've already got run enabled, I guess. What's this? Oh, that's me chopping at nothing. What's this? Parsnip seeds! Here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Journal. Great people. And cultivate and harvest a parsnip. Okay. So, let's quickly clear out all this. I think that is a perfect place to start that little garden. Might not need to clear out this much space considering I've only got 15 of them, but we're going to do it anyway. grass over there. Parsnips planted, let's go and take a look around. That'd be a nice place to put some, uh, the, like, animals or something later. Well, at the very least, it's a nice and spaced out area, which is which is nice for me because I like my stuff all organized in little sections. Let's go down here. He needs another farm. Hop on in here. Anybody home? 
You're not good enough friends with Mar Marnie. Marnie, 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 Marnie. Marnie. Speaking of which, where is everybody there? It's locked. Only Leah's friends can enter uninvited. Fly, little birdies. Alright, let's go around and introduce ourselves. Who you be? Jody. You weren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay, I'm Jody. How did you imagine me? Am I ugly? Is that what you're saying? Or are you saying I'm too pretty? I'll go with that one, I'm too pretty apparently. Who you be? Haley. Yeah, she's pretty. That new farmer boy. Yes, I am. Even though I have never farmed a day in my life. God, that would honestly suck. Not knowing how to farm and doing this. Penny. Just moving away from the city and whatnot. Coming here. Finding out it's a farm, or I guess not really finding out, you knew when you read the letter, but then realizing, oh crap, I actually don't know how to farm at all. I can barely grow grass as it is. Egg festival. Well, I will not be able to participate in that. Marnie, that's where she was. Abigail. Just under halfway. Up in here. Archaeological office. Previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display, but I'm hoping to remedy that soon. If you find any artifacts or minerals out there, let me know. Okay. That's good, because I like to be able to display the pretty things that I find anyway. She looks just depressed. And you look sleazy as all hell. Ew. Yeah, you just look. Ugh. I like how they make the corporate guys look like absolute sleaze balls. doctor's office yet. Who, who are you? Caroline. No doctor? No doctor. Doctor is not in. He's a funny rabbit. And the flowers. Butterflies. Aru. You have. Well, thank you. Great. And I think we've got. Yeah, two other people here. 
Demetrius. Can you get out of my way, please? Thank you. Hello? They're not good enough friends with Sebastian. Okay, well, we're gonna have to meet him later. Fourteen. There's still more people. Mm. Ooh. Hey, Rock. Yay. What else? Is there anything else? Don't look like it. At the very least, I can't meet everybody in one day, so. Let's all go Papa Hoop. Harvey. Local doctor. Ah, that's where he was. Not doing his job. And we've got stuff we can pick up. Like a leak. And a daffodil. A doff a daffodil. And now we go back home. And we've got a bunch of stuff we don't need. Like sap and stone. And I think that's all we don't need to hold on to everything, but also don't want to get rid of things like the the wood is especially useful. So let's Oh, we're almost at our ener energy. Jeez, I wasn't even paying attention to that. It's a nice little house, though. Yes, yeah, sleep for the night. And I think we're gonna end it there today, guys. So thanks for watching. This has been Stardew Valley. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and hit that like button as well as the subscribe button to keep up to date with what I end up posting. I uh, should have my Resident Evil playthrough hopefully up in the next week. I'm still waiting for the game to come, so thanks for watching. Bye!